What's up guys, Spin Firearms here, and this is my CZ P10S. This is an awesome shooting firearm, has an amazing trigger, as you can see, a very, very open trigger guard, which is really nice if you live in a place like me where it does get cold in the winter and you're gonna be wearing gloves. This is an awesome thing to have. I really do like the slim, very thin trigger. On top of that, you have these awesome memory pads right here. Very distinct, very good texturing. Um, it just lines up perfectly with your finger where it should be off the trigger and your thumb, which should be on that pad for shooting, and it ends up being perfect. The one thing I don't like are the sights, but we can swap those out. I mean, they're accurate. They're just the um, night sights that have to be charged up, so they're not always ready to go like tritium. The finish is unbelievable. Um, the finish on CZs and Smith & Wessons are just unbelievable, and I, I definitely throw this in that category. It's different than Smith & Wesson. But it's almost like this shiny material, you know, finish that doesn't have any issues with scratches and stuff. It's actually pretty amazing because I actually dinged this gun on accident. I was like, oh my gosh, it's ruined. And then I look at it, nothing. So really nice. Also, the serrations are deep, but they don't hurt your hand. And I'm not saying hurt is, oh my gosh, I'm in so much pain. But you do notice with some firearms, you go to rack that slide, you do feel a little, you know, uncomfort, I guess you could say. It's, it's not... You feel a little uncomfortable racking it. It's nothing major, nothing that's going to change you carrying this firearm because how often are you going to be racking the slide? It's just something people you know, talk about when it comes to the firearm, and that's my experience with it. Smooth as can be to shoot, but what I do notice compared to a Glock 26, I like smaller, shorter slides on my firearms, and there's a reason. There is more weight being sent up. I know weight really does help with recoil, but the longer barrel allows that muzzle flip to be worse with the shorter barrel it's easier to control because look where your hands are like the closer your hands are going to be towards the end of your barrel it's going to be easier to stop that lift now you can make the argument with weight and so on but i did notice that the muzzle flip on this firearm is a little bit more than a glock 26 and so on but the recoil is actually very similar and like i said it's this is a perfect firearm for those people who like a longer barrel longer slide but a still a small frame this is actually thinner than a Glock 26. Having that small frame that's very easy to conceal still, plus you got capacity, 12 round mags. I'm guessing these are made by Metgar because you can tell they are top notch quality. They look and feel like a Metgar mag, so you know you're gonna have zero issues with magazines when it comes to your CZs and Metgars. Anyways, this is a great compromise for people who have a hard time concealing a longer grip, but still want that longer barrel. Like I said, it's been 100% um, no malfunctions, no break-in period needed. This thing has just ran. And also, like I said, the texturing. This is a firearm that I would not put grips on because for some reason, just these little, I don't know why other companies don't do this, just this little texturing right here is more than enough. And it feels really good in the hand. It's not uncomfortable. It actually feels really, really nice, really ergonomic. And those little dots, all they do is just add really good grip. I don't know why it is that just that does it and all these other companies try and fail, but this grip texture is just, it's perfect. And honestly, it fits your hammer. You can get those two fingers, a little of your pinky. You can go down here if you want, or you can go here um, and get a little of your pinky on. Either way, it's a great shooter. You don't need three fingers to shoot it. You can shoot literally with your pinky hanging off and you're gonna shoot just as good. It's a great firearm. It runs smooth as can be. Um, I would trust this thing with my life and I actually got my holster right here. This is a trigger guard holster from Blacksmith Tactical in black topo using an ulti clip. And this thing is just a perfect overall setup. I'll show you guys right here what it looks like. Very, very nice setup, very small. Um, like I said, I do like shorter barrels and stuff, but this is fine. This is under that four inch. This is gonna be enough to the point where you're still comfortably carrying all day long and not having issues. And like I said, you can trust the CZ with your life. I really like it. Um, really happy that I branched out and tried to CZ. Um, for myself to keep like I shot one at the range and this is the, some guy offered hey do you want to shoot my gun I'm like yeah of course I'd love to shoot that CZ I, I haven't shot a lot of them that's how I ended up with this it was so smooth but I had to get the subcompact model because that is me anyways great firearm very small very concealable very reliable what more can you ask for from CZ